Hey, what's going on? This is Abdullah and welcome back to another video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create coloring books easily and fast using artificial intelligence. This is Abdullah Smitty, uh, Smitty. by Abdullah Smitty here. Abdullah. Abdullah. No! So let me show you some of the coloring images that I that I created using artificial intelligence. I'm going to get on into the details in a second. So I'll show you how I exactly made them. So as you can see, pretty good detail, pretty nice. Uh, I think you can use this for a coloring book, no problem. But not all of them you can, like sometimes you might come up with some good images that you can use and sometimes you can't. Here, here's another example. Okay, so usually when you type in the prompt, which I'm gonna show you. So for example here, I typed scary killer with a with a knife coloring page for adults no noise very detailed high quality clear black lines and black and white so as you can see here so i've tried to create multiple ones so here's another one scary clown with a knife coloring page for adults no noise very detailed high quality black line yada yada uh, and you can use that yourself but we're gonna get into the how to create them yourself uh, in a second so bear with me uh, here i'm just trying to show you what you can actually create with ai and this believe it or not was made within minutes if not less here's another ones there are birds uh what are uh, some images i don't believe you can use them for a coloring book you gotta keep in mind the quality has to be there so in this case i don't think the quality is good enough for this to be used for a coloring book here's another one so this is a pirate holding a sword in his hand Coloring page for adults, black and white, no noise, very detailed, thin lines. I'll show you an upscaled version. Pretty nice. Sometimes you're gonna have some odd things, like for example, it has like seven fingers or something. It looks kind of weird, but yeah. Uh, so this is just to give you an idea of what you actually can create within a few minutes using AI. So the niche that we're going to work on is horror coloring book for adults, okay? So there is some competition, but the demand is there. So as you can see, uh, many books, they have very low BSR, which means people are buying these books. Uh, you got to keep in mind, you're probably going to have to spend money on ads if you're wanting to pursue coloring books. I mean, from now on, I believe, like, if you really want to make a book, book work, you have to make sure the quality is there and make sure that you have the money for uh, advertising your books as well. That's what I think. Anyways, so here's some of the images that been used for a horror coloring book as you can see this is a horror coloring book and those are the images that's been used and if you look here and here similar theme so now let's get into how to actually create this okay so obviously you might heard of it before might not i'm using mid journey uh, it's an ai software that basically you type in a prompt and it generates an image for you okay and anyone of you right now who's watching this video, you can actually access this for free, but only to generate like about 20 images or something like that. So you have to go to Discord, okay? Then you will have to find this server, okay? Uh, it's easy to find, uh, just type in mid journey Discord server, whatever, or I'll leave a link down below so you can check it out and you can get started for free, okay? Then you can go ahead, read the rules and everything like that. But you want to go to newbies here where you can get started. Okay. So what you can do here, you have to start, you have to agree with the rules and stuff. And then you can start generating images. So all of those images that you can see here are generated with the AI. Pretty impressive. So as you can see, all kinds of things, not just coloring images, you can create like literally any thing and it's still improving day by day. So uh, it, it's quite exciting. I thought this will happen maybe in 20 years from now, but it's pretty interesting that it happened actually in like late 2022. So pretty impressive. So how can we create the thing? So I do have a paid, a paid for it. Let's talk about the plans that we have. So there are three plans that you can pick. We have the basic plan for $10, standard plan for $30, and the pro plan for $60 a month. Uh, with the basic plan, you have only limited generations, 200 a month. Uh, I, it's not that much. Like I, I used it, I'm pretty close to like running out of 
generations. Uh, the thirty dollars a month plan you have fifteen fast hours. So this is basically like how fast uh, can you generate images because there are like different types. Like you have the fast hours and relaxed mode. So with the relaxed mode, it's going to take longer to generate images, but with fast, it's going to take like few seconds, sometimes like something like that. And you have unlimited generations. You have general commercial use terms, access to gallery member, same thing as here. Um, it's it's pretty much like the difference between these two is that you have unlimited and you have 15 fast hours and the pro plan here you have 30 fast hour fast hours and unlimited generations and also it's like private mode so like people cannot see uh, the images that you generate do i think it's worth it absolutely uh, i mean it depends on what you're going to do with it if you just want to play around maybe just try the free trial thing uh, if you want to like pursue your business man like there's so many things that you can use this for honestly like sky's the limit it depends on what you want to work on other than kdp other than like self-publishing there's so many things that you can do so uh feel free to try it out so this is like the basic three plans that you have the, the i don't know if they and you have if you want to save so you can do annual annual billing so you're gonna get 20 percent off um but yeah so i'm not paid for this uh I'm, I'm not gonna get any money off of this but uh there are no affiliate links uh, unfortunately but <laughs> but yeah so this is basically like the three plans that you have and i think it's absolutely great compared to the other ai uh softwares out there so i'm gonna use my personal bot instead i don't want to get mixed with the um, you know the public server but yeah so you go here you type in you click on slash then you type in imagine and then you enter your prompt so i'm just going to use the same prompt that i used for this one to show you what you can create so this is the same one uh, this is what i came up with at first but they're going to generate new ones every single time obviously so so go ahead so the prompt is serial killer with a knife coloring page for adults no noise very detailed high quality clear black lines black and white so you can even pause the video right now go to mid journey and try it out yourself so this is what uh was generated after a few minutes so this is uh what they generated and what you can do is you can regenerate the image you can upscale the image and you can make a variation of the image so let's see which one is the best mm, maybe this one so let's make a variation of it so we can click on v2 it's going to take a few seconds it depends sometimes it takes longer sometimes it takes less so it just depends so this is how what it looks like then we can upscale the image so uh, let's see which variation looks the best they look very similar so let's just pick this first one so it's going to take a few seconds again to upscale the image but keep in mind each time you click on a button or something like that it counts as you have generated something so it counts so you only can generate like 20 25 generations so you have okay so now that we have uh, upscaled this image it's still not enough so what we all do is we're going to save this image and then we're going to go to this website called big jpeg um that you can use it for free but i have to pay the subscription as well <clears throat> it's super cheap six dollars to upscale 500 images for valid for two months and you can upscale them to like 16 times we're going to take that image, we're going to have to upscale it because it's not big enough for us to, to use it for a coloring book. So if we take a close look over here, uh, it's only like 1000 by 1000 and that's not big enough. Okay. So what we have to do, we have to upscale this image to, we're going to wait to upscale it to just 4000 by 4000 pixels so we can use it for our coloring book. Just drag and drop. And then we're going to pick the size. We're just going to upscale it like four times. It's obviously artwork. And we're gonna reduce the noise to like the highest okay and then we'll have to wait okay now so we have upscaled this image now we have dragged and dropped it into canva i have a canva installed on my laptop uh, it's pretty much the same but anyway so i took some coloring images uh, so we have uh, here just three obviously uh, keep in mind that you have to keep a blank page between each image so we have to add another one here make sure this is blank for bleed if you ever have ever made a coloring book before you probably know this we will add some shape or something into it because you know you should not leave any page blank but you should leave it like empty for bleed obviously 
So we have only three images. You can just repeat the process. Make sure to have at least 25 images and make sure to be very picky for the images that you use for your coloring book because you don't want to have customers that are complaining about your book and that might lead to suspending your account or even worse terminating your account completely so anyway so we have those three images so this is an example basically go to mid journey preferably you want to have this well you should have the subscription because you can use them for commercial use if you don't have the subscription obviously and you want to have at least 25 images uh, you gotta look at the niche so for example we have this one here let's look at 40 images so this coloring book has 40 images uh, i mean it's getting like some niches it's okay 25 images some niches 30 some niches like 40 i mean it's all about competition at the end of the day so you gotta look at the other books and see uh, how many like images do they have so this pro probably this niche because as you can see here 86 so you have to keep in mind that each page you have to leave one page blank so probably here they have about 40 images as well 40 40 i mean yeah so uh, probably you have you'll have to have at least eg et coloring images in your coloring book and once you're done you're gonna have to go here and then click on download pdf print and then download it and then you can upload this to amazon kdp now so we are going to go ahead to create the cover and we're going to use the ai as well so i have this image over here uh, we're going to see in a second so we're going to go to book o to get the size dimensions so we're going to go to book o scroll down then we're going to enter how the size of the book the typical size of coloring books is mostly 8.5 inches by 11 page count which is about let's just say it's 80 considering it's going to be 40 images and then there we have the size so we're going to pick this one go here here you design custom size inches there you go and then now we go into your image that um i just used with the ai so this is the image you'll need the cover template as well so what we'll do here so we'll make sure the background color is the same as the image color so it looks so it looks pretty good so here what we will need is to add the text so we can go back to Amazon and see what the covers look like. So we have here, here you, you know, there are different types and styles and see which one can you make? Which one are you the most uh, comfortable with or the one who has the most sales? So we have this type which has like black, white and red, scary looking as you can see here, but they all have like low BSR, which means they are selling every single day. Uh, which is good so it, it don't really matter you don't have to really like make a really like specific one i think the one that we have here is looks good enough we just have to add the text so the text is going to be horror coloring book obviously and you can like make unique titles like freak of monster um you can pick the names like freak of horror etc etc so here we, we go and just pick you have to be selective with the text the font that you're going to use on your coloring book as well here let's pick a we gotta pick a font um here i'm not, I'm not gonna complicate the process to be honest i'm just gonna pick a font like babas new the basic one uh, that that would work as well so let's add the text okay so what we all do here we're gonna go to click on effects then click on this echo then click on red so it matches then we're gonna go here line spacing Obviously, we're gonna have to use the cover template. So let me, I'll get back in a second. Well, we have to use the cover templates necessary. So there we go. We have the, I have added the cover template. This is not the perfect size, but here's just to show you the example. If you wanna get the cover template, just go to Google and type in KDP cover template and you can get it for free. Cover template calculator. And then here you gotta pick paperback interior black and white obviously white paper left to right inches page count in our case uh, we have trim size this point mm, and then 80 then calculate dimensions and then you can download the template right here so this is how to get the cover template so here's just a quick example to show you here then we're just gonna have to delete it make sure the background color is the same as the previous one uh, the same color or what you can do you can do this do this um duplicate then flip and then add this right here on the back and then you can add the the coloring pages 
on the back of the cover like this one right here this one right here you can do four you can do six you can do however you like how much ever you like um as you can see here like for the example uh the, the, this one i see in the back they include the uh, examples of the coloring pages i have on in the interior on the back of the book cover so this is the back of the book cover this is the front of the book cover uh, obviously it's not a perfect book cover but this is pretty good okay and uh, if you're uh, curious like how did i generate this it's very simple actually just scary clown with a knife hand drawn and uh, i had to generate like try it like a couple times till i found the one that i liked quite a bit till i made this then i upscaled the fourth one and I then even after they upscale it and I save the image, I still go here and I upscale the image like four times more because this is 1000 by 1000. It's not that big, uh, at least 4000. I think that's a reasonable size to use for your coloring books. So uh, once you're done, then you go to do the same thing. Download PDF print. I mean, print, not standard print and then you download it and then you're good to go to go to canva so this is a, just a brief tutorial on how to create coloring books using ai artificial intelligence to create coloring books uh, i think this is a game changer obviously honestly uh, might be not good for designers and stuff like that who you know we used, i used to hire illustrators on upwork to create coloring images for me now i do create this with ai but i still do use some illustrators to be honest but I think this is going to make things a lot easier for a lot of people. Uh, it's quite impressive, to be honest. But yeah, uh, I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. We're going to make more uh, AI-related content on how to use AI for your coloring books and other stuff as well. So make sure to like and subscribe. So this is Abdullah, and see you in the next video. Peace.